Hello folks and welcome to App Screencast. In today's video I'm going to be demoing an application called I forgot the name of it, Smart Shuno. Um, basically what this application does is it will actually tidy up your certain folders or it can tidy up your desktop and so on. So like me, you might be the same, you might not be, I don't know. You might have, your desktop might be really cluttered, really messy. You might have loads of images on it, loads of videos, etc. Loads of different types of files. Or it might be just certain folders you're really messy, like my download folder is the most messy folder ever. It's just got hundreds of downloads, not doing anything. I've used them, unorganized, real mess, never can find out in it. So, I was looking for a way to organize, keep my desktop tidy, or my download folder. And the application I come across is Smart Shuno. So what I'm going to do is quickly demo what the application does, and hopefully you get a good gist of what the application is all about. So we'll start off with on my desktop. I've got three images. I've got two videos, and I might want to organise these. Now I've got a video folder here, and I've got a picture folder. Obviously, pictures I want to put them into the picture folder. Videos I want to drop them into the videos folder. Obviously, easiest way to do this is just grab them and drop them. But let's just imagine a scenario. Use your imagination a bit. Imagine the images. There's a lot more images. Let's imagine there's 20 images and there's 20 videos. And this picture folder is somewhere else on my computer, it's not on my desktop. Same with the video folder, it's somewhere else on my computer. So, obviously sorting all the videos out, grabbing them and stuff, it, it takes a little bit of time. These are a quick way to do it, especially if you've got hundreds of video videos and pictures like I have in my downloads folder. Um, Smart Shuno can actually do it for you automatically. So, let's start off. First off, you open Smart Shuno up. And you have to create some rules. So not they're not really. It's not really too. It's not too hard. But I'll show you how to do it. So first one, add the first rule, call it a name, call it pictures. Target folder. Which folder do you want to actually organize or sort out? So choose that folder, and it's actually the desktop. So I clicked on the desktop. So as you can see, desktop. Next up, what what do you actually want to sort out in the desktop? I'm going to do it, you can do it by file name or by extension, by file size and a few others. What I'm going to do is extension and what is the extension, make sure you type this out right, JPEG, because all my images are JPEG if you can see, file extension are all JPEG. So make sure you put JPEG. Next one, which folder do you want to send the files to? So I'm going to add and I'm going to find it and it's actually the picture folder on my desktop. As you can see desktop slash picture well pitch so you can also move them to trash if you wished so you've got various options you can do and you can even choose to change file name and so on but I'm not going to do that for this for this um, demonstration okay so that's rule one created but I'm also going to create a second rule and I'm going to do it for the videos so add a new rule call this rule whatever I want I'm going to call it videos target folder is going to be the desktop again because I want to clean the desktop up. File name, nope. I'm going to go extension again. Um, AVI, so as you can see, the, it's video.avi, so I've put AVI here. Same with this one, it's AVI again. So it's AVI files. Where I'm going to move it to, add, it, add a folder which is going to be the videos folder. Choose. Okay, rule created. So my two rules have been created as you can see here. If I don't want them to be active, I can unactivate un them. But I want them both to be active. So now when I click do now, it should actually clean up my desktop. So fingers crossed, let's see if it works. Voila, they've disappeared. Where have they disappeared to? Pictures have gone into the picture folder. And videos have gone into the video folder. So as you can see, it's worked pretty well. So generally that's the basis of the application. It's a great way of sorting up, sorting out your files on your desktop or in a particular folder, move them to other folders and start organizing them basically. And it's, it's a really neat little application if you're someone who's got a lot of files and you need to sort them out. Also what you can do is you can go back into your rules you created and actually edit them and tweak them, change them. So if it hasn't quite worked, you can go in and change it or if you want to change the way the rule works, brilliant. And obviously, you've got some different ways to obviously sort the files out, as I discussed. And also, you can move them to the trash if you wish. 
So there's a little bit more to it. This is just a quick demo of what it actually does. But obviously, when you download it, you obviously can look a bit more deeper into the application. But like I think I said at the start, it's a simple application. So it's nothing too taxing. It's not too hard. It's not too overcomplicated. It's it's really simple for what it actually does because it is quite a quite a mundane task sorting out all your files. If you've not um, keep if you don't keep track of them, if you don't like organize them regular, you can suddenly have a big folder full of files, and you it takes ages to go through them, deleting the ones you don't want. And obviously, this application can help you. So what I'll do is I'll leave the link in the description to your right to where you can download download the application from. It is a free application, and it is really tiny, and really small, so it's it's going to be a quick download. And I definitely recommend this application. Can't recommend it enough. It's what I love to see is a free application. What does a job and does it really well. I think this application does that perfectly. So yeah, definitely check out the application. Have a look more because obviously you can look into it deeper. I've, I've just gone over, quickly gone over the basics. But obviously you can sort files out various different ways. So definitely worth checking out. So yeah, thanks for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to check my channel where I've got loads of videos on the Mac, very similar to this, and so on. And also, don't forget to subscribe because it'd be much appreciated. And uh, I'll see you later. Thanks for watching.